excited. Sandy's so excited. Oh, <laughs> isn't she cute? Do it again, girl. Get him, Sandy. Get him. Oh, hi, bug. <laughs> Get a playful. Oh, she gets this. Oh, she goes. There she goes. Hi. Oh. Oh. Banjo. Oh, he's so jealous. <laughs> yeah, we got to put water now. We just stopped. Yes. Yeah. He's thirsty. He was trying to tell us he was thirsty. Yeah. Oh, girl. Hi, girl. We love you. Banjo. Yeah, just get a drink. Look at Sue. She says, hi, Mama. Hi, <laughs> Sweet girl. Hi, honey. Hi. Yes, are you thirsty? You want to get a drink? Well, he's still drinking. He wouldn't drink earlier. It was raining. I had his little drink thing in the car, and he, like, turned up his nose. Oh, so I had to pour out the water. Now he's making up for it like a camel. Ah! She stuck to my boot. Help! Help! Her collar got there stuck. We go. There we go. There we go, honey. You want to get a drink now? Come on. Get a drink. Yeah, come on. Let's get a drink. It's enough. Drink. Get a drink. Get it. There we go. Yay! She's like, nobody be watching me. No better Betty be watching me. Get a drink. We are stopping at Klein's Corners. It, we've stopped here before. It says it's the largest gift shop on I-40. They even have an RV park. I don't think that was there last time, but they were building it when we were, look at that, that's huge. I wonder how much they charge. We're not staying, but we're just stopping. But that would be nice to know, because you guys might want to know how much it is, because it's really convenient. Like if you're tired and you want to stop, they have five acres of truck parking on the west side. So if you are boondocking or something, that would be good. But if you wanted to plug in, okay. So it's called, and we're gonna probably get gas. I have almost. I have. A half tank that means he probably has a quarter so we're definitely gonna need gas um so let me get parked here hi how are you feeling good good me too it's such a gorgeous day say hi daddy <laughs> oh, you're stepping on my phone say hi daddy hi daddy he was in the back sleeping and he heard me say he heard mama say hi and he was like who's yeah. that yeah Banjo, have you got we're at Klein's Corner. yeah let's go in and take a look and they have 99 cent fountain drinks oh that's all you need to keep pit stopping every 5 15 miles all right let's go yeah all right let's go in and check it out we need to find a place to walk the dogs we forget there's not really a bunch of grass here and once you cross over into New Mexico there's not a lot of places to pee your dogs sometimes just talking about this kind of information is helpful to other travelers in case people are wondering why are you talking about your dog's potty and well because when we first came out here um, we had never been to New Mexico and and we found out real quickly that you know our dogs they're kind of spoiled to grass and when you don't have grass it takes an awful long time for them to go to the restroom. I know that's weird, but maybe they're spoiled or maybe they're just dogs. They like to pee on grass. Um, so, you know, we try to cater to that. And so anytime we find grass, we try to stop and let them go. But that that's kind of a good point. If you have picky dogs, like small dogs who, you know, are kind of spoiled or big dogs or whatever. Um, Uh-oh, now she's already going on the rocks. But yeah, he'll go after she does. But anyway, this is the patch of grass that they have to go on, and and uh, this is Klein's Corner. Cute travel center. We really like the Russell's uh, travel and truck stop just across the Texas border into New Mexico. And uh, this is another travel stop we like to stop at. 
it's probably a good, I don't know, I would say an hour and a half to two hours away from the last one. So I'm saying we're stopping like every, at least every two hours. <laughs> I know that's crazy, but we've got seven different bladders that need to be emptied every, every so often. So we've got to do that. And then, um, yep, let's head inside. We're just waiting on this little guy. He's my neurotic one. He's the picky one who has to find the perfect spot on everything. <laughs> All right, so we found his perfect spot. Now we can go. We gotta wait for the cars. We stop, look, and listen. Okay, they're waiting for us. Let's go. Yep, I remember this place. I got those like red and green chili chips, I think, here. I didn't really like them. Remember I almost got one of these last time, like we all did? But yeah, they're kind of itchy, so. No. How much are they? $8.99. For a pound? LB means pound. Oh, okay. For pound. If you want a pair of good boots, they sell them, but they're very proud of them. They have nice high prices. I want the Route 66 one, but I'll get it down the road. But I really like this sticker. I think sugar skulls are really cute. So I'm going to go ahead and get that, and then the kids are going to get some taffies. Come on, guys, put your taffies up here so we can pay for them. Watermelon. I want a watermelon one. Will you give me a watermelon one? This looks like Neapolitan. That looks fun. Is it good? Mm hmm. Is it good? Yes, ma'am. What kind did you get, Neapolitan? Yes, ma'am. Mmm. I got Wonder Melon. There's the baby. There's the baby. We we're gone a full 30 seconds and he's already up in the window like, where's mama? It's in the 60s here. It's awesome weather. We need to add some states to our map. Lots of states. So we'll do that. That makes me really sad. Our Oregon sticker came off. And I only had this one from Buena Vista. This one that I just got, and then we had an Oregon one, and it fell off. Darn it. Now I want to go back to Oregon just to get a sticker. I put peanut butter on their Kong treats and put them in the Kong, except her, I just dip it in peanut butter, and then there's a piece down here she missed. Thank you, Sissy. Aww. She's a cutie. She's like, oh yeah. <laughs> Angel says, oh yeah, mama. Okay. All right, look at him. He's like, uh-oh, now you can't get the rest. And I'll have to crush it all up for him, but that'll keep him busy for a few minutes. <laughs> all right, so now we have to go gas up. He's so cute, I'm trying to get his peanut butter out of his Kong. Arizona. We are right now at the spot where we were when we first started our full-time journey here at McHood Park in Winslow. This was probably the second, second or third, probably second place we stayed, boondocking. Um, there was maybe one or two other campers here and now it is full. Everyone has caught on. So now I'm just showing you around camp a little bit. There's plenty of people here and we're gonna go say hi. How are you doing? Good. Good. Aww. You got your fire going. Nice. I figured oh, yeah. Have a morning fire. Oh, yeah. heck yes. yes. And there's, oh, yes. look at him poking his nose. How cute. <laughs> and there's our rig. I guess Marsha. Marsha took oh. off? Yeah, so she went into Walmart. Okay. Oh, Walmart? Where's that at? In Winslow? Over there. Is it in Winslow? Yeah. Right on. Hey, Jake. Oh goodness, look at the clam, it's all winterized. <laughs> Looks great. <laughs> That's funny. Go check it out. He's got his whole kitchen in there. Let's go check it out. Hi Jake! Look at big Jake. He's such a sweetheart. 
There's Ace's little spot. They've got their car or their dice and their kitchen. So cool. Be careful of all the prickly. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Step on them. Hey, you got your socks and shoes on though. She's about to go potty, so we're gonna need to pick that up. And what are you doing? I got a pair of socks. I left them in my backpack. Um, last time it was cold because it got warmer. So I'm gonna put them on my feet. Hi, Ace. Let's go say hi to Ace. Come on. Hi, Ace. Go say hi to your buddy. Go on. Oh, Jake. Here, Jake. Come on. Look at Neil's place. How cute is that? I like his uh, emblem on the side. Looks like there's quite a few tents out. Last night when we came, there were uh, several tents. In fact, when we first came into the drive, lots of people have found this awesome campsite. Here's a tent. It's just a beautiful day. It probably says it's in the 50s, but it doesn't feel that cool. It's uh, on this reservoir here. Another tent over there. Yeah, it looks like some people may have left. This It seemed like this whole area was um, full when we got here last night. It was dark when we got here. Y'all want to sit on the picnic table and I'll take your picture? Because I took your picture on the table last time. I want to see how much y'all have changed. <laughs> Change a lot in a year, it looks, it seems like. Hi, everybody. Thanks for watching for Tiny House. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, hit the like button, and share the videos with your friends. And we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to leave us a comment.